New York, where business never sleeps. This is Squawk Box. Small business optimism ticking up last month. Entrepreneurs are more optimistic than they've been uh, since before the financial crisis. They're now investing in their companies, and the demand for capital is booming. Uh, Steven Scheinbaum is the founder of Merchant Cash and Capital, and, and we think about uh, sometimes that um, the other thing to note, Stephen, is that what small businesses, if they are in trouble and they need cash, that's one type of loan. But if they're actually in a good position and they're going to expand and they're optimistic, that's a different position. And that's what we've turned to now instead of needing cash to, to sort of plug holes. Correct. We have, see, we have seen a tremendous shift over the last three or four years in the use of proceeds. After, shortly after the recession, most people were taking money as a lifeline to try to, <laughs> yeah. to, try to survive. But now people are taking it to grow buy inventories, open new locations, hire more people, and it's, re it's really been an exciting story. You wouldn't change your interest rate based on how desperate people are, would you? Like, no. They were 20% loans back when they needed it, now they're back down to 4 or 5%. No, that, you're not allowed, that's against the law, I'm sure, right? We, yeah, we, we, don't, we don't do that. Technically, we buy, <laughs> technically, we're actually not a lender. We, we right. buy future revenues at a discount, but our pricing is just based on an applicant's credit. But it, what you, in, in addition to that shift, you have seen another shift that you've noticed, in, just in terms of general optimism among the people that you're dealing with. No doubt, no, no doubt about in, it. In the last six months, last year? In the, in, the last year our in the last year, our business has doubled, and small business owners are normally reluctant to take on a lot of to How take much on money are we talking about average? Um, we, our average deal size is around $40,000. We go from $5,000 to $300,000. And you are, so you are talking, these are, are mom and pop small businesses that, they, like, really, the life, these are, this is the area where we really wish would, would recover because of middle class, uh, you know, the income disparity and everything else. These are the people we really like to, to do better. We finance about a thousand merchants a month, small businesses, franchisees, guys who own um, Jiffy Lube, Dunkin Donuts, mom and pop diners and restaurants, auto parts and repairs, hair salons across the spectrum. Are the increases, the, the improvement in sentiment, is that across the spectrum too? Or are there certain areas where either geographically or by, by type where you think they're really feeling better? I, I think in, in, in we see a bunch of increase in areas where the housing market has recovered, where, where the economy has been down for a while and you start to see that recover. But gener generally as labor has tightened, Business owners become more confident. People are out spending. Oil going down has put more money in people's pockets, so spending is up a little at the small in, in the small businesses. Why? So these are are too small for for established banks to be involved with. What, what what's the deal there? Why why is this huge niche available to you? Why is it left you we, know, intended? Prior prior to two thousand eight, we were deal, we were mostly financing the unbankable. You know, restaurants, retail businesses that had a lot of cash at, at some point or weren't open long enough or didn't have credit to qualify for bank financing. But since then, it's changed as more institutional money has come into our space. We've been able to create lower cost, longer term products. And, and there's been a tremendous influx of technology. And so we can now approve a loan in about 10 seconds. We can fund in about two hours. And the likelihood of funding and the certainty well, why of can't a bank why undercut you? Why, can, why can't a bank do what you're doing and do it cheaper? Um, I don't their, think their cost of capital should be should be lower. Cost of capital cost of capital is much lower. I don't think the the banks are willing to do a forty thousand dollar a forty thousand dollar loan like they used to. Because it's just not worth it to them because the risks are too high. What's the it cost, distinction? We're trying to. They're, they're not nearly as automated. They're not nearly as automated as we are. We're a non recourse product. People come in, they fill. Uh, they can come into our portal and in 20 seconds or in 30 seconds find out whether they're going to have an initial approval. Um, right. And it's just a much more seamless and frictionless process than dealing with a bank. What are your uh, bad loan rates? Um, we collect, or we, we charge off around 8%. What do you think of all these new services on deck? Uh, a lot of the guys out of Silicon Valley, Lending Club, things like that. Do you feel like you're competing against them too now? Uh, on deck is a direct competitor of ours. Okay. We also do a lot of business with them. I think they've done, they've done a fantastic job. They've brought real legitimacy to the space, made, brought real awareness to it, and, um, and we're very much like that. Lending Club is a little different. Right? Lending Club is more of an income statement business, and we hold the vast majority of deals on our balance sheet. Okay. Sounds good. Thank you. Maybe you really are doing God's work, unlike Goldman Sachs. Well, maybe. I will, I will tell you, you know, small Except business. Except for those 20% the loan shark rates when during the crisis when you said here if you need that but you didn't do that we did not do okay that. okay uh, would, we would were, your business be if we went into another real slowdown 
could you be at risk again? Because you have no collateral for any of this stuff, right? That's right. We could be, although we yeah. came through 2008 and 2009 in okay. a real positive manner. All right, Stephen, okay. thank you. Thank you very much. When we were